or joy fuel? Okay, today, the question is, is it time for a liver flush? Uh, in my opinion, absolutely. If you haven't done one, uh, this is one of the fastest ways to regain control of your health. Um, it's amazing the transformation in such a short time with so little easy ingredients for the step-by-step -step process. And how do I know that it's time for a liver flush? Well, for me, my body tells me, and also my perception. Uh, the, the links in my body, that when they tell me, I get little brown, little, little liver spots on my cheekbones and jawline occasionally. Also, if I'm feeling bitter, like, for me, that's my sign that I'm off balance. And, you know, let's come back, go within, get some stuff out, and then return to balance for more joy, fuel, and exuberant enthusiasm. And because the liver, like I also, it, it's the fire element, you know, if it's out of balance, we have too much fire. And for me, I can be judgmental. I can certainly be like, lately it's been, oh, I don't like the system, this, the system, that. Yeah, it's not necessary. And this is a, one of the fastest ways that I've found to get rid of that heat and that excess fire and return back to loving oneself. And of course, how do we do that? We do that with water and earth. Really easy. So what I've been doing, I've also noticed that uh, with my tongue scraping, it gets a little, uh, the bacteria comes off as acidic and bitter tasting. So there's no wonder I'm feeling bitter if my whole body has got that extra fire. And also I've noticed in my Bikram yoga practice, I'm, I've got that fire, I'm, I'm, I'm solid, my, my practice is, is really quite coming along well. But then afterwards, I'm just I'm feeling the need to flush. So apple juice is usually one of my things I go for because that cleans and flushes the liver quite nicely. And part of this process in the liver flush is a one liter per day of apple juice flush, ideally in the morning in between meals. So what came to me this time, I was just at the supermarket and ideally fresh is best. I didn't have the facilities for juicing, although I could make a plan one day. Uh, so I'm there, apple juice, that's good, but I'm just not feeling it. And then I'm drawn to something else. And that was apple black currant juice. And of course, as a kid, I loved Ribena and everything apple and black currant, like juice boxes and poppers were beautiful. They were like heaven for me. And then I realized that obviously that's a step back to my inner child and what I actually need. So I've been doing that for the past few days feeling tremendous as a result and also looked up black current and what the benefits of nutritionally how they have on the body and of course there's a lot of iron and I have in the past been iron deficient uh, I've sorted that out mainly I have had a little bit of a spleen thing in the past couple of weeks so that is certainly helping also is a lot of vitamin C and huge antioxidant capacity and f you know for getting rid of those free radicals and because I've mentally decided that I'm going to do a liver flush on today which is Saturday and then my body starts to kick into gear you know it's, I start feeling okay there's a bit of liver stuff going on there I went for a run this morning just a gentle 7k run and because my intention was to deal with my liver I could really feel it going so my performance wasn't 100% but hey we accept ourselves because we're going through a process and it's gonna lead to a much higher good so this will be my 14th liver flush in the last two and a half years or so and i've also stepped well dozens of friends and clients through this simple process uh, both one-on-one -on -one coaching and also in retreat settings and the, usually the things that people come back to me with is great i just i don't feel as angry anymore you know i just i just dropped it it just disappeared and it really is quite wonderful to see uh, because people's eyes light up, their face shines. And because the liver is the seat of the soul in our Egyptian and Sanskrit and Ayurvedic practice uh, studies, practice, well, practice is a study, isn't it? We're always practicing, studying, more learning. Then 
That's the seat of the soul. And of course, our body and being in our bodies, in our subconscious mind that links through our subtle bodies to the source or the sun, whichever you prefer to call it, is absolutely vital. I've seen people totally transform in a weekend. And after they clean their liver, all of a sudden they're not burdened by this heaviness. They've got a, a certain alertness about them. It really is quite wonderful. And if you feel this is right for, me, for you, and I'm sure it is, I can post some more details and feel free to send me a message and we'll step you through the process where you can have more vibrant enthusiasm. Yes, please. <laughs>